It's time to drop the hammer. Drop it need for Emerson Axum down on the inside. He's going to two-foot that thing onto the back straightaway with Justin Grant winging off the cushion down the back. Shoot into turn number three. Going to keep him company here. They roll across for lap number one. Axum's going to lead the charge. Meanwhile, Justin Grant on the attack. Look out. Axum slips up off the bottom. Came up and shut the lane down. Justin Grant caught him by surprise. You can see the what the look on his face as Buddy Kofoy's going to wing one out across. There's your first slide job of the night. Grant easily turns it back down to the inside for the number two car and charges into the corner. Kofoy's going to work the bottom onto the front straightaway. Axum leads him across for lap number next. Four score and into books. Grant back by car length and a half. There's top three. It got out away from fourth on the field. That's Cannon McIntosh duking it out with Dason Pursley as Kofoy pulls a little probe down on the inside. A test slider, if you will, for the 67K car. As Grant goes after your top spot, races his way through. That was a drive job. Out across, a little slip of the grip. He'll look back down to the inside. Here's your slider. Slings it out through. Four and a fluff for him. High side of the racetrack. And unfortunately, yeah, for him, for Justin Grant, Emerson Axum slips through. And Buddy Kofoid as well. As Grant's got to get back to the whip again for the number two car. Kofoid slips up right on the snoot. And the number two car clipped these whiskers for him. And now Grant's got to get back to the throttle again with now Cannon McIntosh closing. Grant's not able to get back around the outside. He'll throw a slider down into the corner. A slow one. And Kofoid's able to clear back around. That was a touch of the tires. Down at the apex of that quarter, and again they're close. Nose to tail, out of turn number two, down to back straightaway. McIntosh watching it all go down for the number 86 car, back fourth on the field. Lap traffic lies ahead. Shannon McQueen will be the first one to fall victim to Emerson Axum up front if he can catch her. She is lickety split. Grant with a slider on Kofoy. Kofoy back down to the inside. That battle for second, third, fourth, and soon to be fifth. Tremendous out of turn number four. Seavey's finding speed now. He's coming to life. Good hustle down into the corner. Cannon McIntosh slips up off the bottom. CV says, see you, bye. Hit picks off a spot. Moves that 57 car up one more position. It's heavy lap traffic now for Emerson Axum. A little dodge through the eye. The needle picks off McQueen and E both. Down into turn number one and two and down to back straightaway. Keep an eye on him. Look out, he ran out of real estate. On to the binders hard. Ede on the high side. It's going to get brushed by the wayside. Grant slips through the inside of Kofoy. Meanwhile, CV slipped through there like a ninja. Moves himself into second on the field. Kofoid and Grant are still duking now and wondering how the blue car got out ahead of them. Pound in the rim. Onto the front straightaway goes Emerson Axum. Axum's going to have to dodge down to the inside if he's going to clear the next car. And here comes Seavey low peak. 57 cars got to move down into the corner. Hustles it on the high side. Axum down low. Leaves himself open to attack. Here comes Seavey big wheelie. Oh, score Axum there. Still got that top spot. Slams the door in the face of CV as those two cars continue to duke it out with Buddy Kofoid entering the fray. Kofoid snuck up on the back of him. Now goes down to the inside looking for moisture for the 67K car. Into the mix, CV. Bold move down low. Corners his way through. Axum's able to turn it back down low for the 68 car. Not able to get up there and challenge on that top spot. Kofoid's right there. 67K back behind as CV goes. P1 for the number 57. Axum now running the gun and trying to keep in touch with CV. As they charge into the corner. Eight laps remain this time coming out. CV's not out of the woods just yet as we go one into the fence. Up and over. Red flag coming out. Gavin Miller launched up into the fence, rode the rail, and then flipped at the very end. So he is set to pick up the pace. He's going to the high side. Ooh, a little tricky. So down into the corner he goes. Justin Grant's going to capitalize on it. He was tweaking on the knobs in the cockpit of that race car. Took a shot at Axum. Couldn't make it stick. Axum able to get back around into second on the field. Meanwhile, in the back behind, Dason Pursley is able to escape from the 25K car. Boy, she just winged one out across there. Dragging herself up through it. Another slide job just ahead. We have unleashed the hounds in these final laps. There's your white flag coming out for CV. CV rifles down into turn number one and two and on to the back straightaway for the number 57 on the quest for his sixth feature event win of the year. And more points for him as he leaves Bakersfield Speedway. That drive for the championship looking stellar for CV.